two shows. Y'all ready to unbox one? Well, y'all, y'all see it? We got another unboxing tonight for you. Thank you for joining us here at Drone RC. We have another unboxing. We haven't done an unboxing in a while. I haven't bought anything in a while. Yo! It, 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 yeah, it's been a while. So, um, but what we got today, we got uh, another uh, free wing model from Motion RC. Really excited about this one. This is uh, my dad's. Uh, this is RD's. Um, me and mom pulled together and uh, Artie's birthday is coming up so we'll go ahead and say happy birthday to RD. Okay, he's got a birthday coming up and we decided to say you know we're gonna get him an airplane. Why not? I mean I want you to get an airplane mother for a birthday. Right. But not only that we need some more in the hangar. Yeah. We don't have any room for yeah. it. Yeah. But we're gonna make room. Um, so we're gonna box this thing. See what we got. Free wing from Motion RC. This is the F20, uh, I'm not sorry, the F18 uh, 64 millimeter uh, promotion. A practice plane. The practice plane. Y'all been watching, y'all been watching the videos. Y'all seen that already does have the 90 millimeter um, F18C Hornet. Um, beautiful airplane. Y'all seen the unboxing. Y'all seen the, the, uh, the final build on it. Uh, and if you follow, uh, follow us on Instagram, um, you've seen a ton of pictures up there uh, on that plane and, and where it was and where it's at right now. And it's a beautiful airplane. But we want to, uh, Dad's like me. I want, to, I want the big 90 millimeter F-22 and eventually I'll get it. Um, but I'm going to get the 64 first. And I, and I think he's doing the right thing. Yeah. I bought the 90 millimeter, uh, but I'm not going to fly it. Until, I have yet to fly a jet. And Keith has been flying the uh, Air, Air 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 same Well, he's had a little, he's had a little. So I bought this airplane, or they bought this airplane for me, uh, because I, I said I wanted to fly and get used to EDF before I could put the big one in there and move it. Yeah, we want, you know, teach is on, everybody has their own way of doing things and, and, uh, I, I'm like RD. I mean, you go out there, you, you take a six or seven hundred dollar, you know, jet, and you something happens, you crash it, and it hurts. Especially, yeah. especially when we buy them strictly out of our pocket. We work hard to get the, the planes we have, so we just thought that it'd be a good idea to get these little sixty fours. I say they're little; they're not little. Um, and, and play around with these and get used to them first before we fly the big nineties. So anyway. Without further ado, we are going to unbox this bad boy. And it is the, uh, it is the free wing F-18E Super Horn. Y'all have probably seen a bunch of uh, videos on this airplane already. Uh, I don't know if there's any, there's very many unboxings out there to see what, exactly what you get from free wing. But we're going to show you today what you get. Uh, in the box when you order this this plane. It's a beautiful airplane. We've seen a lot of videos on it. So Without further ado, you know, they call them. I didn't know this They call them that a Super Hornet Yeah, the Super Hornet has square intakes. I think mean, that's got the round intakes, don't it? I think I don't know. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out if it's got square ones or not. We're going to have RD pull the box. We can slide it. There it goes. It's coming out now, boys. There it is. Okay, it's going to come out. So be careful. There you go. All right, good deal. All right. Obviously, great packaging by Free Wing and Motion RC. That's awesome. All right, yeah. So, y'all see. There she is. Packed up pretty good. Pretty solid. Let's see what we got in here. Obviously, we got the most important thing in any airplane, your manual. Uh, tell you what, let's do something. Let's uh, do the small parts first. So we got in here, I think this guy's where you can do either or, maybe, I don't know. Uh, nose cone. Uh, I guess it was called the 
blast rings or something? I don't know. Yeah, it's tail cones. Yeah, tail cones, and then you got the ends of the the plane. It's a missile on the missile mount. On the end of the wings there. Um, let's see what else they send you. I just want to show y'all exactly what they send you when you order this plane. Cause I haven't really seen anybody completely unboxing one of these. Maybe, I, I don't know. Uh, vertical? Vertical stabilizers. Actually, these these do not. Oh, that's cool, look at those. 90th anniversary. Top headers. Yeah, top headers, look at that, y'all. Those are cool. On the back side, got a little dice inside the um, star. Look at that. Those are pretty. Those look cool. Put a little clear on them, boys. Yeah, we're going to clear these bad boys. Look at there. Those look really cool. I like them. I do too. I like that. Almost as good as my werewolf. Yeah, that looks good. I like that. Uh, landing gear. So this thing does not have retracts. It just has the gear. They they stay down. They're permanent. They don't they don't fold in. But you get your retract, your front, and your uh, your main retracts. Those yeah. have no steering though. Um, your two exhaust jet exhaust. There's two of them in there that you get. They call them turkey feathers. Turkey feathers. I want the gobble. Moving on. You got your wings. Wow, that's some short little wings. And the itty bitty. Your two wings. You must get it off the ground. Your two wings uh, with your um, ailerons. I get a little close up on them. You know, have you noticed? That they are, that, that you, it's cool. getting harder and harder to see the cells of the foam in these things. Yeah, you can't. They're really you, coming a long way with that. Yeah, you can't really see. This thing right here is slick. Yeah, it don't look like foam. I mean, on the bottom, you can see the, the little, I don't, I don't know what you call them, but you can see the little, you, if, you got, if you're got if you foamy, you know what I'm talking about. But on the top part, it looks like slick. It looks like honeycomb on the bottom, don't it? Yeah, like the little honeycomb thing, yeah. But other than that, the top of it, that thing is slick, man. That looks good. So there's your wings with your ailerons. Here is your horizontal. horizontals. These are, they work all the Flying stab. Yep. There you go. That's the reason I wanted that airplane. It's got a flying stabilizer on it, like a stabilizer on it, like uh, my big one. And, and, and again, you can see the honeycomb on the bottom, but on the top of it, you can't even tell this thing's a foamy. That's nice. So you get those. And then last but not least, you got the fuselage. Well, you got, they, they send you some glue, your little screws, your little parts. You got a couple of push rods. You got a, um, what they call China glue. <laughs> That's some good glue though, y'all. Yeah, that is good glue. That, that stuff right there works. There's your, your hardware. And then last but not least, you get your uh, fuselage. Looks really cool. Like that. You know, I, I question this airplane actually. When you watch some of the videos and you look at the pictures of it, I'm like, eh, it's like, I don't know, that thing won't, I don't know. But now that I see it right now, that thing looks pretty cool. That looks like an airplane we took together, you think it is. Yeah, look there. Turn around and look, look at it. I did a super hornet. Look at the intake. The intake's a square. Yeah. See the intake? Right there. Oh, right here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right it's square. Yep. You're right there. On well, the other Hornet, it, uh, ramp, they're round. I did not know that. That's a pretty little plane. I like that. Let's get, let's get a little close up. Got a cool looking little dude in there. I hope y'all can see that. Cool looking little guy in there. Um, the top of it. I mean, that's a good looking airplane. Look. <laughs> that thing's cool looking. I like that. That yeah. ought to be a cool looking. That ought to be a good, good flying looking. It actually looks as big as some of those puzzle planes we're flying. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah, that thing looks cool. 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 Yeah
So that's what you get, guys, in the unboxing of the uh, F-18 Hornet, Super Hornet, from Free Wing, 64 millimeter. Like I said, I haven't seen too many unboxings of it, but, uh, and then, like I already said, there's your square intakes, which is a Super Hornet. Yep. That is neat. That ought to be a cool, that's going to be a cool looking plane when it's done. You get those horizontals on there. Oh yeah, that's gonna look good. That bad boy's gonna look pretty sharp. Look there, yeah, that's gonna look good. That's gonna be cool. What y'all think? Put it. It's gonna be put it. Put it. Y'all comment down in the uh, uh, section down below. Comment what you think about it uh, on the unboxing of the free wing um, F eighteen C Hornet. Guys, Super normally, Hornet. normally, F and I have been for a while kind of disregarding the 64 millimeter because I'm thinking look I'm thinking yeah the little ones stuff like that yeah you know yeah. and and that's a bigger airplane than you think it is yeah and if you got the uh if y'all if you guys have the f86 arrows f86 um Y'all know how big that plane is. It's a 64. It's not a bad size plane at all. No, it's not. But that that right there is that's gonna be a cool looking plane when it's when it's put together. You get it cleared up, put some majority RC stickers on it somewhere. Yep. Maybe some small ones across here or something. I might put the stars on it. Yep, it's gonna look good. Y'all thank y'all. Thank y'all for joining us. I know it's a short video, a short unboxing, but I wanted to show y'all exactly what you get when you order the free wing. 64 millimeter F-18 Super Hornet. And you get everything you need. RD's gonna clear it up before we put it together. Customize a little bit. I don't know if he'll do any painting. It's gonna be totally on him. Uh, I guess we won't know until we get everything you know started on it. But um, got another build for y'all. We're gonna do some. And, and like I said, if y'all are not following us on Instagram at Jordan RC, make sure you do that. Because what I do is I, I post a lot of pictures and short videos over there of our builds and updates on what we got going on here in the hangar and, and outside the hangar. And also, if you're not subscribed here to the channel, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I do short videos as well of what we got going on with these, <laughs> with these airplanes. But um, it should be a, a fun little build. I'll do some short videos of it and uh, we'll, get her, we'll get her fixed up and ready to go. So. Maybe you need to tell exactly what we're going to yeah, guys there's a shortage of electronic stuff everybody knows we fly the admiral admiral 600 you can't get them they just can't get them so we have went which we have flown these before the latest radio master with the latest radio master and the arrows gyro you will have about the same amount as you would for the Admiral 600. So we're going to go to that, and that's what he's flying to that arrows over there, and that arrows flies fantastic. Yep. So we're going to go with this right here, and we're going to let you know how it turns out. Yeah, we're going to put some new stuff. We're trying out some new stuff. They don't have the R168, which is what we started out flying with Radio Master. They quit doing that. I understand there was a problem with. Uh, they had they had some things on their receivers that, that they weren't allowed to have on there, and there was a some kind of something. Anyhow, they they took away some of the stuff on the 168. Now the newest one is the R88. This is an eight-channel receiver. We have yet to have a failure with a Radio Master receiver. Yeah, no. we've not had one. No. Not a good receiver. And those are 168s are. They're, 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 they're nice too. Yeah, but you can't get them no more. They yeah. just continue them. And the vector, as far as, far as my money's concerned, the vector is as good of a, a, a gyro out there as it's on the market. And that's from Arrows. That's uh, from Arrows. Uh, uh, Tower Hobbies. I mean, I'm sorry, Hobby Zone. Hobby Zone, where Arrows is, uh, they got a bunch of Arrows stuff over there. These receivers are eight channel and they're less than $20. Less than $20. And the gyro is 20 bucks. There you go. So you got 40 bucks in a set, a total setup, where the Admiral 600 was 34 or 35 dollars. So five dollars more, you got a complete setup. Um, so it's 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 a good deal. So go to Hobby Hobby Zone 
and uh, you can pick up those arrows uh, vectors. And you and can get these. Grayson has the, Grayson Hobby's got these. And Grayson Hobby has the Radio Masters uh, R88s. So go check them out. Thank y'all so much. I hope y'all enjoyed the unboxing of the, the new plane. Uh, we're gonna get to build and see what we got. Y'all stay around. Don't go nowhere. Please subscribe to the channel. Make sure you follow us on Instagram at RC as well. Until next time, guys, thank y'all for joining us, and we'll see y'all on the next video. God bless you.